Hello friends, Tony here. In this video I want to work with uh, departments. We are going to make a CRUD and display all the departments in a table. So first what I'm going to do is to open the terminal and create uh, a table for the departments. So I'm going to say artisan make table and instead of cities now let's say departments and uh, Let's say departments like this. Okay, now let's open. And first, I'm going to delete the cut of tables. I'm going to delete this one. And now let's open the cities. I'm going to copy what we have inside here and go to the departments and paste it. Okay, next, let's go also and copy what we have inside the form method and paste it inside the departments. We need to make some changes and also we need to import the allowed filter. Also the collection from the Illuminate support collection and the query builder. Now the search is only for the name because only the name we have on the department the query builder is going to be for department and uh, make sure you import department here okay then we have the allowed source for the id and name and allowed filters for id and name okay remove that and then with global search for name column id and name is going to be sortable and let's remove this and also the filter here. Okay, and let's save. Let's close. And what I'm going to do now, let's go inside the resources views admin and the cities. I'm going to copy and paste this and rename. And I'm going to name it departments like this now let's go to the index first and here let's say department index okay to create a new department we need to say admin departments create and also let's say here new department good the table is going to be for departments and also we need to add a single department here so the table assign department and yes we need to change also the routes and on the delete let's say delete the department like this okay save and close and now let's open the department controller and we are going to return here to the view so return and also the view is going to be admin dot departments dot index Okay, and we need to pass here the department and say departments class, which is uh, the table. So make sure you import that. And if I save this and close and let's open the browser, go to the departments now. Yeah, we have only the search here and there are no items to show right now good let's start and work with the create method so i'm going to open the city controller and let's copy what we have here just to save some time okay and i'm going to paste on the create method import the split form also we need to import the input 
and that's it only the input so from the form builder not the select and yeah we need to import the submit from the form builder and the action is going to be admin departments store input name and the label save okay also the classes it's going to return the view admin departments create and the form and we are okay then let's go and create the request so open the terminal and artisan make request and not create city but create department request and use now on the store method that one so create department request let's open this change the authorized to be true and also we need only to validate the name here so let's say name is going to be required and let's say maximum of I think let's open uh, let's open the table so departments table and yeah we have here the maximum of 50 characters okay Now let's save and let's close this and let's say here department model make sure we import that create and now other sign request validated okay and let's open again the city controller because we need to import this one the copy sorry and I'm going to paste right here say not cd but department created and also we need to import this one and return to the route admin departments so just paste it here and i think we are okay with the create so now let's try and before that let's open the models because always i forget yeah here we need to add the protected that are sign fillable which is going to be an array with only the name and let's save and close now and let's try on the browser if i refresh and let's click on the new department here we have only the name and let's say here Laravel. if i save yeah department created we have here and let's say also the view.js department and new one for the live wire yeah here we have now we can sort by id also and we can search for example view yeah good and let's work with the edit and delete let's open the vs code and start i'm going to remove the show method now for the edit here always i use route model binding so let's say department dollar sign department and let's come up here copy this and paste it on the edit and we need to make some changes here first it's going to be the admin departments edit the return then the action is going to be route admin departments update okay also we need to add here the last time the department and the method because here we are going to update so let's say method because by default method is post so let's say method put the fields is a name okay also we need the so right here 
we need to fill the field so let's say field we need to fill the field so let's say here uh, fill and pass here the department and i think we are good now let's save let's go also change on the departments create not create city but create department and save and also on the edit edit department like this save and now let's try okay now let's go here and work with the update i'm going to use the same request so let's say create department request i always i prefer to create a separate request but now i'm going to save some time so let's use that and let's say here department dollar sign department and let's update now so department update the request validated okay and then we need to return with the post notification so let's say department updated and also we need to return the department index okay the last thing let's because we are here let's work also with the destroy so department dollar sign department and first we are going to delete the department the so department delete and then add the toast to say department deleted and the last one is to return back here and i think we're okay now let's save and let's see on the browser refresh i'm going to edit the laravel yeah we have laravel here laravel up save and we have laravel up let's edit and let's remove everything save the name field is required now let's say laravel again and save good now if i delete this are you sure no if i want to delete are you sure yes and that's it now we have a full crowd of departments and that's it about this video if you like don't forget to subscribe to my channel and like the video because it's going to help me to rank on youtube all the best friends and see you in the next one